Now tonight we are so excited to introduce our first guest. He's been on our show before and he's here again to lend his expertise. Please welcome celebrity vocal coach James Lewis. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So this is definitely, most definitely the final bass video. I, I got, we got it going on. We figured it out. Well, we're getting we're getting there anyway. So here's here's I wanted to kind of put it out there to see what y'all think. We got my Sans amp right here, my kind of cleaner DI right here. I've got my bass amp simulator track, and I've got my bass distortion, which has uh, a little another Sans amp on it. So here's without any amp sims. So we're going to try four of them. We've got the uh, UAD SVT, the UAD B15, the UAD Galen Kruger, and the UAD Eden. So we'll start with the back to no, no sin. <laughs> SVT. Eden I don't own. This is on. De this is a demo. The other three I have. Uh, Eden's real, uh, real like kind of. I don't, know, I don't know how to explain it. Like kind of cl clacky, and uh, kind of hi-fi. Almost sounds like the old like Trace Elliott amps. Anyway, there you go. So, back to it. Here is the UAD SVT. VR, I guess. I don't know what it's called. It's the SVT. Mm. B15, and this is in 66 mode. What's weird about this is like the treble acts as a gain. It's really cool. This is 66 and 66 bias. <laughs> Galen Kruger. Kind of 
has a similar thing as the Eden. It gives it a very kind of like a, a active -y kind of, I feel like I'm playing bass in Mariah Carey. An effects rack on this, which I haven't really delved into. Filters, trims, crossovers, yeah. Eden. SVT. That's just sounds, this is rock and roll, baby. That's rock and roll, baby. Here is the uh, B15. Lights up yellow or uh, purple when you're 66, green when you're 64. I, I like the 66 and the 66 bias. I would just like sit and cut, and like you'd hear it, and it would be so nice. Galian Cruz, like the rhythm of love, it's very 80. It's cool. And Eden. Personally, doesn't do anything for me. SVT. And V15. Yeah. Yeah, they're all nice. Not really the Eden, though. The Eden, the, I'm taking that off. The, the I'm not into the Eden. Gilly Kruger's cool. I used that one a lot the last couple of years. I don't know. It's just time for a change. The SVT, I mean, this just sounds like, sounds like, you know, balls to the wall, man. It's like you can hear around it. You know what I mean? It's really 3D in here. And then the B15. It's flatter, but it's more like... So, it's been a, it's been a good experience, guys. I'm really uh, enjoying this. I feel like I'm getting somewhere with this. And basically, that's just my, my Yamaha Active Passive PJ... Uh, into the Sans amp, and uh, the the one side is straight into the this side is straight into the burl. This side is is coming out of it and going into the A designs uh, thing. Hey, what's up, buddy? So yeah, and then here's our bass amp. So there it is, SVT. That, that also to me that sound lends to that part you know because it's just I feel like I want to have like that undulating B15 man both those are just fantastic what do you think Bo? he's like I don't care is there food involved 
All right, so yeah, kind of, you know, I guess, I don't know, man. Maybe, maybe comment on what you think or not. I don't know. Tonight, and the next one is da 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 I think so. I mean, I grew up on that record, so I've listened to that a few million times. Yeah, tiny, but something dancer, little dancer, little that, whatever. Peace!